Hey everybody, it's me, Sean. Welcome back to Artificer and our uh, little guy is wandering around. He's got so little health, but guess what? I went to the uh, uh, Discord and they explained, I ho hopefully they explained what I'm doing wrong. So I need to select the algae bandage and then I need to right click on myself. Hey, look at that. My health is going up. Great. How much does it heal? It looks like it heals one little circle for each bandage that I use. So that's really good. Now we'll be able to do more fighting, uh, which is nice. And we can also gather um, things like the uh, the um, stone and whatnot. Oh, and also, I believe I'm supposed to push F to attack. Whoa, there we go. Well, or not. So why when I pushed F did it open up the other thing? That's weird. Okay, so that does attack. But now it's not attacking. Weird. I don't understand. Why did it attack sometimes? But oh, oh, he's dead. That's why. <laughs> he's already dead. But there's nothing I can do with his dead body, unfortunately. Can I use the pickaxe on it? Can I use the regular axe on it? No. Okay. Well, still very cool. I uh, am going to need, whoops, I'm going to need more bandages, though, that's for sure. All right, there we go. Let's, um, I believe I already mushed up all of my mushy stuff. So we're going to need more mush cane, that's for sure. Let's go to the thing. There we go, bandages. Great. One, two, three, four. That's all that I have. Whoa. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. Good. They didn't disappear. Great. I like that. Can I mush up these witch caps, I wonder? Nope. So it's just the mush cane, huh? These guys? I don't know that I would want to. But apparently those are not mushable either. So how do you make paper? I ask. Did I try putting logs in there? Or sticks, maybe? Nope. Hmm. All right. Well... One of these days, we'll figure that one out. Okay, so we've got our little markers, so we don't need to worry about getting lost, or at least we need to worry less about getting lost. Just have these going. I suppose it eventually we'd get to where we could have, we could um, set up a, a area where we can't see one of these. Oh, also I read, <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> On the Discord, I read that the reason we have the little lag spikes is um, because the um, generation of, uh, you know, whatever's going on in the thing. Now, see, I placed that guy behind the tree. That's not going to be helpful. I'm going to place another one up there. All right. Um, let's uh, gather up the stone since we're here. Very exciting. Yep, tink, tink, tink. And uh, probably it would be easier to see. Well, first off, it would be easier to see if I uh, adjusted the brightness again. Um, uh, easier to see if I had a torch. I think that is... I Like, the game isn't telling me that, but I think that's part of the game, is that you need a torch to be able to see at night, which is why it seems very dark and uh, hard for you guys to watch. I guess the first intention of the uh, game designer was not making Let's Plays. Although, don't get me wrong, he's been very generous in giving this game out. I'm not the only person. Uh, uh, I'm probably, from what I was reading over on the Discord, I'm probably one of the larger channels to be featuring this game. Which, as you know, is... Oh wow, I didn't even think... I thought I was working on the one that my mouse was hovering over. Um, anyways... Um, that is an unusual circumstance for me. I would not normally be a large channel uh, in, by any stretch of the imagination. I'm quite happy with the size that we are, don't get me wrong. But, you know, it's not, not what I would expect. This guy over here, he really wants to come attack me. But guess what, buddy? I know how to fight now. You want to come attack me, I might be able to uh, attack you back. Come get me. Now, why am I tempting fate? I should not be doing that. 
All right, let's get back on our, oh, lots of centipedes. Don't want to be fighting those guys. Dang it, I am never going to find any shells at this rate. Um, and, <clears throat> oh gosh, <coughs> excuse me. Oh, my throat. I don't know why it got so uh, jammed up there. I got, I got all emotional. Um, all right, so I have lots of these weeping agarics. And I, um, I guess I would need some more logs. So I'll just cut down some trees. Oh, you know what I should do? Uh-oh. Dang it. <coughs> Excuse me, I should, um, cut down the tree that's in front of my little light, <coughs> light thingy. That's one of these guys down here, isn't it? Where's, where's my light thingy? There it is. So I need to cut down one of these trees. Or both of the trees? So I wonder if, ah! I wonder if that sound is like a, uh, is like the tree's defense mechanism or something, like it calls for, uh, calls for help. And that's why the centipedes show up. Hard to say. This one's not calling for help. So maybe that is related. Maybe the centipedes only show up when the trees are making that funny noise. Hmm. Very mysterious. I like it. I like the mysterious nature of this game. And one thing, like, I think it's a lot of it would have to do with the uh, early access, uh, uh, you know what I mean, like in development nature, um, in the sense that, oh, I guess I didn't cut down the tree that I thought it was going to. Um, it's, it's not so much that it's like making you figure it out for yourself. It's more that the, okay, so, it's more that the, uh, The game just doesn't have a tutorial yet. <laughs> All right, let's heal up here. Looks like he tying he heals up by tying his shoes. Get those shoes nice and tight, and I feel much better. All right, I still cannot gather the. Uh... Nope. All right, I, I do want to get this tree out of the way, though. There we go. And now my thing should be completely visible. Very good. And I'll gather up those logs. Thank you so much. Which will allow me to make more trail markers. And trail markers, nothing else. Very useful. So I need... I need some of that... Um, some of those mushrooms that allow me to... Oh, these guys are the... Uh, that's the mush cane. Oh, I gotta stop leaving these behind. Because that's how I make my bandages. So, lakes are very useful. Too bad I can't pick this bad boy up. Can I? I can't, I can't cut it down either. No, nope. and uh, would it do me any good if I did this? Nope. <laughs> it does not do any good. All right, well, this is an interesting attempt anyways, I guess. Okay, let's put that back. I said, ah, for crying out loud. There we go. And we're going to head back to the camp. And now all of a sudden I've got plenty of these guys. Oh, and here comes a, here comes a monster. Look at you, jerk. Uh, don't kill me. They only seem to take two hits, but their poison is very poisonous. Well, there's a bunch of stuff hidden behind that tree. All right. You don't need to gather more branches. But I could use more mush cane, that's for sure. And we've got plenty of logs, so I can make a whole bunch of um, pathfinders. We're going to have so many of them, they're going to become pointless. Because if you have them everywhere... And they're they're not going to do any good, uh, but right now they're going to at least represent the cardinal directions, 
as I believe I've already said. Okay, so I need to mush up this mush cane. And we'll just let that do its thing while in there. Very good. Three, four. Now, somebody said on the Discord, they were like, uh, oh, there's at least an hour's worth of play in this game. Well, we're well into an hour here. And um, I, I feel like there's still plenty to do. So I don't know how people get through these games so fast. <laughs> I, I guess I'm just slow-paced and... Goofy or something. All right, now. Is that like a used stone axe? I don't want to waste my stone axe by making a torch. I wouldn't mind making a fireplace, though. And we have enough stone for that. Let's, uh, what is a fireplace going to allow us to do? Fireplace. Item in this slot will burn. Result slot. Place fuel here. Hmm. Will the branch work as fuel? Well, I'd rather put a log there, though. And uh, so what happens if we burn sand? Result slot. Nothing. Okay. Clay? Nope. That would probably go in the kiln. Um, dotted algae. No good. Laminator. Doesn't do anything. Mush cane pulp. Nope. Hmm. Uh, witch cap. Still doesn't burn. Do I not have the right kind of fuel? Do I need a branch? Do I need to click on something? No? Hmm. Well, snakeweed? Nope. Still nope. Okay, well. It's worth worth trying. Probably like food. You could could make food if I had some sort of a dead animal or something. Hmm. Well, it's alright. Well, why couldn't make more of those bandages? I have uh, mush cane. Oh, okay. I guess you can only make five at a time. Oh, five in a stack. Hmm, all right. So we do end up running into some stack issues. So we do have at least a uh, an eventual encumbrance level. What else did I want to make? I do want to make that shell knife. We have all the other stuff. A kiln is not a bad idea. What are we going to get out of this kiln? All right, so place fuel here. That's easy enough. Log. Clay. What else would you kiln than, a, than clay? What does that make us? Bricks. All right. Interesting. Um, sand. Well, I can guess what that's going to make us. Glass. All right, that's cool. Stone? I guess I need to empty that out first. Those bricks are huge. All right, stone? Stone doesn't do anything. Wow, we burned through those logs. You know, luckily we have plenty of logs. How about that stuff? No. All right. Um, hmm. Interesting. What is this going to do for us? Charcoal. Yeah, baby. Let's make two charcoals. All right. I uh, like that. Dotted algae? Probably not. No. Nope. These things? Hmm. Okay. But I like that we got a new... <laughs> we got some new stuff. Um, did that open up any new recipes for us? Doesn't seem like it did. We could make a charcoal torch. That is exciting. Um, so if we have it lit, there we go, look at that. And we can turn it on and off at will. Cool beans, okay. Um, and over here, I think we've uh, decided that there's really 
nothing else we can, or there's really nothing we can cook here, right? All right. Well, that's too bad. Oh, let's not leave those logs in there, though. I want to carry those logs with me, and we're going to we're gonna heal up. Oh, let's use that one bandage. There we are. And then we're going to chop down uh, additional trees. Oh, sounds like there's going to be a centipede. I, I don't know how I would get away without getting hit. Pretty hard to fight those guys without losing a thing of health, so really need to make sure you um, keep your health up, I guess. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Keep keep bandages on hand. I'm going to make some more of the trail markers. How did I lose them? There we are. Oh, they used two logs each. That's a lot. All right, there we go. But they also you also make three of the things, so it's not like we're going to run out. All right, go back to highlighting that. Very good. We're going to keep cutting these trees down. Uh-oh. Is that it? Is he dead? He's dead. All right, I'm not. But... I lose uh, uh, basically a full health every time I fight one of those. So I kind of need to keep the bandages coming. I'm not sure where I'm going to... Well, I just need to go searching around. I'm sure there's more mush weed. I think there was some down to the south east. And I'll uh, go look there in a second once I gather up all the debris from these trees. All right, let's head down. Well, we haven't really done a south... Uh, line of markers yet, so let's go ahead and do those. Let's try doing them the correct way, like that. And I'm going to put this one on the other side of these trees. There we are. And this one will go on the other side of these trees, like that. And I'm just going to keep on. Like, oh, hello, centipede. Can I make my way around you? Ha ha ha, I'm faster than you. I'm kind of faster than all, all these creatures, so. Um, yep, I don't like that, they, that the uh, marker got kind of covered up there, but on the other hand, I can use context clues to figure out where it's supposed to be. Oh, another centipede. Oh, a bunch of centipedes, actually. Just want to place a thing, oh no! Run away! Let's see if I can go find some more mush. Mush, mushy, mush, mush. There shouldn't be um, any centipedes hidden under this log. I think that's a safe bet. Isn't it? Is it? Chop, chop. All right, nothing. I wonder if, um, if I can attack these little little guys. No, those guys are fast. What are they? It's not that's not a pig, that's like a mouse or something. Ah. Too fast for me. And I don't have the opportunity to uh, attack them either. All right. There we go. Feather rat. Cool. All right, let's gather you, 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 and you. All right. Can I attack the, um, nope, can't attack that guy either. So I'm going to gather these uh, heel roots up, and then we're going to, we're going to make our way back uh, so I don't get lost. Come on. I just want to gather the weeds there. There you go. Great. All right, and I can't attack that guy either, can I? But I have investigated them before. Yeah, that's why the little magnifying glass is not coming on. How many of... So it takes, it takes two of these, so I'll need 16 of those. 12, 13, 
14, 15. So I just need one more. And there's probably some back at the at the base. 10 survival points for surviving a day. Good for me. I made it. There we go. That's, that's number 15, 16 right there. Nice try, Snakey McSnakes a lot. I know you're a centipede. I can tell the difference between centipedes and snakes. One of them has a bunch of feet. You're welcome. All right, let's see what we can get from these logs. Looks like they should have like uh, mushrooms or something on them because all the moss and whatnot. But I don't think we're gonna get any of that stuff. I think all we get is logs out of them. And here, this is what's left over from the giving tree. I'm gonna chop up the stump. I think that the Shell Silverstein would realize that even with a stump, you can get a bunch of logs out of it. And the giving tree can continue giving. That's what it's all about. Uh -huh. Oh, really? There's an examining? Examine the stump. Three survival points. Okay. Thanks. Lots of stuff to gather up here. Nope, I don't need you to chop the tree. I, I mean, I guess you're going to allow me to, and there's not a thing under it. I'm going to keep on whacking at that tree until it falls. Okay. Gather the stuff and head back. There's one of my direction jobby dobbies. So we're going to follow that and uh, go around this little clump of trees. And there's some of that seaweed stuff. And then another thing of trees with the uh, uh, direction indicator hidden behind them. And more algae. Yep, and now the direction indicator is much easier to follow. Okay. So we need to mush up the... Uh, uh, this stuff and get those going now I wonder can I throw some of this on the fire I'm gonna try it because they're one of the science things that I've studied is like heat treatment so it's possible that like right I don't know we'll find out I'm just gonna put the one on there nope doesn't do any good okay hmm how about like putting bandages on there? Nope, no good. Um, and I've tried pretty much everything else. Bricks? Nope. <laughs> uh, all right, and uh, and the the snake weed doesn't do anything. Hmm. Okay, no problem. Um, let's go ahead and make up those bandages. Bandages. There we are. And we're going to craft, 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 craft. And, uh, put in our inventory. And then craft, craft, craft. There we go. And put those in our inventory. And we are set. Um, oh, can I smash up the snake weed? Nope. Have I tried? I've tried doing witch's cap. And I've tried doing these bad boys. Did I try doing paper? I mean, I guess I have. Well, whether I tried it or not is a different question. Hmm. Glass? That would be interesting, wouldn't it? All right, bricks. <laughs> make sand, <laughs> and then go turn that, or make clay, and then go turn that back into a brick. It's the circle of life. All right, guys, um, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Um, let me know what you think. I am still having fun. Uh, we're not, I mean, I don't know. I mean, are we getting anywhere? Probably not. But we're learning stuff and exploring new things. I think we're having a good time. Let me know what you think. Uh, leave me a comment down in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. Click that like button. That is a great thing for you to do. And I will see you next time. Bye.